Austria is electing its next president. The counting is almost over and exit polls show a second six-year term for Alexander van der Bellen. Austria's president is set to stay in office for a second six-year term. Alexander van der Bellen won a clear majority of votes and will be able to avoid a runoff, according to projections based on almost all votes cast. Speaking to supporters, he said the win has significance beyond Austria's borders. Europe has won, he said, and that the importance of a united Europe in the face of Russian aggression in Ukraine had won. Van der Bellen received just 56% of the vote, while his main rival from the far-right Freedom Party, Walter Rosenkranz, garnered nearly 18%. That's based on a projection by pollster Sora for the national broadcaster, with 95% of the votes cast in polling stations counted. Neither of the main centrist parties fielded candidates in this election. 78-year-old Van der Bellen is a former leader of the Greens and has built his image on having a steady hand and a relaxed manner garnering broad popularity for projecting calm during times of national crisis. And he's seen his fair share of crises, including the collapse of the government in 2019 and the resignation of Austria's chancellor a year ago. The Austrian presidency is largely a ceremonial role, but does have sweeping powers that involve overseeing periods of transition and turbulence. The president is also the commander-in-chief of the army and can sack the government or chancellor.